It's a concern for patients and for some clinics that uh, fresh donor eggs uh, may be better to use than frozen donor eggs with regards to availability of number of eggs and also the cost and also uh, the pregnancy rate and live birth. To some extent regarding the number of eggs a patient gets from a fresh donor cycle, uh, it may be true that they might get around 10 to 35 eggs if they have a fresh cycle of egg donation. Uh, whereas when they purchase the eggs from an egg bank, for example, they may get six to eight uh, eggs cohort. However, something that needs to be uh, mentioned here, which is very important, is the fact that majority of the patients that actually do go for egg donation are, of, uh, are women of advanced age. So therefore, they're only looking at having one or maximum two pregnancies. In Europe, when you look at the cost, it's very much neck to neck. It's around 10,000 euros if you go either way, They're using a frozen egg or using a fresh cycle. The difference in the cost is where you have surplus embryos to freeze. So with a fresh donation cycle, you may have many embryos available that you could freeze. And should the patient not get pregnant, they can come back and actually use those frozen embryos. And a frozen embryo transfer cycle costs a lot less than a fresh treatment cycle. We provide training to all the uh, labs or clinics that um, purchase the eggs from Cryos International and we actually visit the clinic and, and help them to, to do the first door for them and teach them how to use our technique and for that reason the pregnancy rates are now um, almost similar to the fresh cycle. Our success rate with our Thawing of the eggs is around 92% survival and uh, pregnancy rate is about 75% per embryo transfer and our blastocyst rate is around 50%. With fresh egg donation, you have to wait sometimes around three months to up to two years to be able to have the treatment. Whereas with the egg bag, you can immediately purchase the eggs and have them delivered to your clinic within about a week time. It's um, quite interesting to see now for the first time um, that the frozen egg donation cycles have actually exceeded uh, in, a, in, in a recent report that came out in US, they've actually exceeded the fresh, fresh egg donation cycles in 2017 by 128 cycles. And I think that is an indication where patients are appreciating that having frozen egg donation is probably just as good as having a fresh cycle of uh, egg donation from donors.